When I learned that SADC had just entered Congo, I was happy because they came with the objective of helping the Congolese people fight the enemy who hurts us. I really like SADC because it gives itself to help our country. She always does it in a very good way. That is why I encourage them and welcome them in peace. The difference between SADC and the EAC is that the EAC did not come to fight, but SADC comes to help the Congo. SADC comes to fight alongside the Congolese. And what we want is to have those who come to fight to help us drive out the enemies of the Congo, these enemies who harm the Congolese. This is why we are happy with SADC because it comes to fight for us. She comes to help the armed forces to drive the enemies out of the night. SADC, like the ESC, may all have the same mission to help the republics as they all declared, but for the East African community, when it came, they were already stained. They were among the countries that we know very well are attacking us. So the population showed this distrust, and it is legitimate. When we see East African community, it's Rwanda, it's Uganda, it's Kenya, which is also there for the majority of times when you see we stop the terrorists in Beni. They are also Kenyans. When there is here in M23, you find the Rwandan and the Ugandans who are in there. This is why we didn't really inspire a seed of confidence. This is the difference between the East African community and SADC. Because on one side, there is always a history of repeated wars, and on the other side, there are countries that always come to the aid of our country. When the EAC arrived, we thought they were coming to help us, but we found them to be hypocrites. Upon arrival, they sided with the M23. But SADC, when it came, it was with the intention of fighting the enemy. And that reminds us that it had helped us before in our country, and we had won the war. And we welcome them knowing that, with the love we have for each other between the Congolese and SADC, they will win this war. We are only waiting for the results on the ground.